Yo, I'm back again and today we're doing a CSKA Moscow play ratings, bruv. Shout out Kyle. So today man are in Russia, bruv. Like another one of them countries, yeah. Not known for the football, but man's looking for the gems. That's what it's all about right now, bruv. Now, nickname the army men. So so you already know what it is, bruv. Like no no fucking around right now, bruv. Now owner say it's love the club as well, so that's good to see. Obviously, no continental competition because Euro Cup. There's only four teams left, they're not in there. Arsenal have got Villarreal, if Arsenal do not beat that team, this video will probably come out after that game, so man's going to make a prediction, yeah, man are going to be 1-0 down in it, and and that's my prediction still, let's let's move on, history, um, have they won the league, yes they have, one time, two time, three time, four time, five time, six time, within 2000, that's mad bruv, they've won it six times, two double seasons, they've been doing, they've been doing their thing still, but yeah, let's look at the squad bruv. All right, we're going from Igor Akinfeev all the way to Salomon Rondon. Flipping hell. So, yeah, let's see what they're saying. All right, we're starting off with Igor Akinfeev, bruv. Now, um, first choice goalkeeper, I believe. Um, 12 agility, 15 reflexes, and 14 one on one. So, obviously, the pivot that I look for is starting to wear down a bit in the physicals. You can't really control them with your age and that, bruv. You can't control them still. Um, for his things that he's got, though, the reflexes and the one on ones, they're, they're still good, though. And overall, he's still got a lot of other things as well. Like he's he's actually very good overall. I can't lie. Mad anticipation, bruv. Like he's he's, he's actually very good still. Um, obviously, like I said before, the one thing he can't control is what's going down. But when I look at the history, how long has he been here? Since two thousand and two. Give man a statue, bruv. He's been consistent with it for how many years? It's going on twenty years, bruv. You have to you have to give man a statue. You have to still. Like he's been going in still. But yeah, overall he's he's a good um first choice, you get me, but not for longevity though. Like I do know that you're gonna have to replace this guy, so you could probably make him your backup. Yeah, that's probably what I would do still. Man like Igor Akin Thief, bruv, cool. Yeah, so I'm not really gonna lie, I don't think this guy can can fulfill the boots of Akin Thief. Still, you're probably gonna have to loan this guy out and bring in someone new. Like, either the same age, even a little bit older, but as long as it's under the age of, like, 20, 27, like, then, then he'll last you a couple of years still. He'll be the perfect um, goalkeeper. And um, and and in terms of this guy, give him a loan, bruv. He's, he's not really level still. 14 reflexes is good, yeah, but 12 agility and 10 one-on-ones, it's not, it's not what? It's, it's not the one. Man's definitely going to get pecked, bruv. Like, it's, it's peak still, man. Like, Ilja Pomazun, bruv. Don't, don't waste your time, bruv. Like, yeah, give him a loan still. Uh, next, you've got a 21-year-old Bruno Fuchs, Brev. Um, now, 12 agility. I mean, 12 acceleration, 11 agility, 13 pace, 13 strength. Physically, he's just okay. I mean, obviously, another case of man's going to step out, get fucked, turn around, and, and then attempt to duck a man down. 13 tackling as well, under average by one. But he's got a lot of under average by ones, which is calm because he's only 21. I mean, that if those 13s turn to 14s, you're going to be looking at him very, very differently still. So just give him time, bruv. Um, 14, 10, 8, 10, vision, 12 pass, knee claims, ball playing defender, can I allow that? Just can't really see what he's doing, but with time, I do believe that the pivot will improve. Oh, however, however, I should have seen this at the beginning. He's gone for five to seven months, so everything that I just said is going to be halted by about a year still. I can't lie, by the time he comes back, he'll be 22. That's a year choked off, bruv. Peak, can't lie, very, very peak, bad injury, torn hamstring, bad injury still. At least it's not a recurring one, but still it's bad. But yeah, um... Overall, that, that injury is going to mess him up, but he, he can still, like, he has the potential anyway. So, yeah, Mal's still using, man, like Bruno Fuchs, brav, cool. All right, next we've got Victor Vassin, brav, 31 years of age, 8 techniques, 6 vision, 12 passing. Yeah, he's not essential. I mean, he can kind of pass, but it's going to be a fucking struggle, brav, I'll tell you that. So, don't waste your time still. What I'll tell you to do, I mean, when I look at the physicals, hold on a second, he's 31, 10 agility, 10. 10 acceleration and 10 balance my goodness me he's gonna get fucked bro i can't lie he's gonna get spun bruv like ah uh, it's gonna be ah uh, that that's peak still um and he's not even that strong as well and he's six foot four no composure listen he's uh, the only thing that i can really take from this guy is that he can jump head the ball and tackle that's it and the three things that i just listed you are 15s bruv so you already know what he is he's a flipping no nonsense impersonating essential defender as they all do. Let me move on, bruv. Uh, next, you've got Igor Diviv, bruv. Um, 20 years of age, so um, got a bit of potential, but let me just look at the stats. Yeah, 11 acceleration, 10 agility, 13 pace, 15 strength. So, obviously, once again, 
in terms of starting speed, it's going to take him a while. You know, when you was a child, you had them cars that you had to pull back for them to start going. That's that's what my man is. And that's what all of these men are with dead agility and dead acceleration, bruv. My man have to pull pull them back to, take, to get them going, bruv. That's all they are. But yeah, um, when, when you do get them going, they're, they're, they're moving a little bit. Can't lie, bruv. Not side to side, only in a straight line. But yeah, 15 strength is very good. Um, what's his tackling? 13. He's only 20. So for, for his age, that's not that bad. If you just keep on playing him because you can't directly improve tackling, you you might be able to improve it still. There's no guarantee in it. I can't really tell you anything apart from that still. So yeah, um, mentally for his age, he's decent as well. And yeah, my advice to you is just play him and, and play him, bruv. See if you can develop the agility and stuff. You definitely can double intensity that, bruv. Um, yeah, he's a no-nonsense though, not a central defender and call it a day after that still. I mean, not call it a day, just just keep on playing him. Just keep on playing him. I'm like Igor Deviv, bruv. Cool. All right, next you've got a 17-year-old Vadim Karpov, bruv. Um, promising centre-back, 13 pace, 12 agility, 12 acceleration. 10 strength, he's only 17, man can allow that. He's a central defender. Ah, uh, they've lied to him. You know the ones when man's been lied to from young, in it? Like, that's how it happened to everyone. But listen, he's a no-nonsense, bruv. Um... Not a central defender, eight technique, eight vision, nine passing, no passing ability, bruv. You can't play flipping central, so slap him on no nonsense. But because he's young, um, he's, uh, you know what? I think Mal probably loan him out still. Mal give him some first team football on loan. If the team that you loan him on, I mean, if the team that you loan him to doesn't give him first team football, then just bring him back. But 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 because he's still young, it's it's not that bad still. But yeah, man, like Vadim Karpov, he's, he's decent though, can't lie, man. Uh, next we've got Kirill Nababkin, bruv. Now, um, he's 33. 9, 11, 11, 11. And, and then I don't care about natural fitness when everything's gone apart from the strength. <laughs> nah, listen, um, oh, he's gone for six to seven months. Yeah, I can't really look at this card anymore because his career is basically over. His time has come. Like flipping Master Ugwe from Kung Fu Panda, bruv. Man's time has come. It's time to hang up the boots, bruv, and just call cool it a day. It's still cool. How many defenders do you... I've been on this defender section for time, bruv. Hold on a second. Now, this is another defender. Um, Centre back, 12 technique, 8 vision and 12 passing, bruv. Um, 10 pace, 11 agility, 11 acceleration. Nah, I can't lie, man. Not level still. He works hard and, and that's about it, bruv. I can't lie. I mean, he's strong and he works hard. No, no mobility. He can't even stand in the right position. I personally, I'm not going to play this guy. And, and yeah, man, I'll call it a day. Still can't lie. He's, he's not that great, bruv. Not, not for me anyway. Yeah, not for me still. All right, next we've got Mario Fernandez, bruv. Now, he's 29. Um, He claims wingback defender. I can't really lie to him, yeah. Listen, he's he's not a wing back defender. He's definitely limiting himself by doing that, bruv. He's he's definitely better going forward still. Um, mad pace for his age. He's he's booming still. Can't lie, especially in a straight line. The overlap is mad still. Um, the dribbling's not even that bad. It's under average by one. Crossing under average by two. But man, 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 let that slide still. Um, first touch cushioning it, bruv. Like just just cushioning that first touch. Can't lie. Um, fifteen technique, eleven vision, but fourteen passing. So he's got mad execution and technical ability. Just cannot see what he's doing, bruv. Um, tackling 13, that's that's the main reason why I would never put him on um, wing-back defence still. It's definitely a going-forward thing. Mad anticipation as well. Yeah, mentally, he's different gravy. I can't lie. Physically, very good as well. He's another one of them, you know, them mad tool full-backs, bruv. So physically, he was going to be good anyway. But yeah, man like Mario Fernandez, yeah. Very, very good right back, bruv. I can't lie, bruv. Very good right back still. Uh, next, you've got Georgi Shenikov, bruv. You get me? Um, 11 technique, 8 vision and 12 passing, wing back defend, 12 tackling. Yeah, I'm not going to lie to you, man. Um, he's, he's not level still. I mean, he's meant to be staying back and winning the ball. He's got 12 tackling. He's definitely going to get split, bruv. Um, that pace, it's, it's nice. It's all well and good having pace if, if you're trying to recover or if you're trying to bomb forward, bruv. On the bomb, on the bombing forward thing, mythical, no dribbling. On 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 the getting back thing, man can just about win the ball. Meaning that penalties are definitely coming. They're coming, bruv. I can't lie. So personally, I can't play this guy because I know that he's just fast and that's about it comfortably. Still, yeah, man, man like Georgie Shenivikov, bruv. Cool. All right, next we've got Van Nutnyev, bruv. Um, he is an every. He can literally do anything apart from centre back. Do I agree with that? Um. 
you know what? <laughs> you, you actually know what? Listen, yeah? I can kind of, un- I can see where he's coming from. Like, literally, he can do everything. So there's no reason why he can't play anywhere if you can do anything. The only thing that he can't do, because he can do so much, I can actually list them. Can't take penalties. Who cares? Can't mark. Who cares? Not a leader. Who cares? Not in the right position. Who cares if you can be anywhere? Why do you need to be in one position, bruv? And he's not strong. Who cares, though? He can do everything else to an 11, and he's only 22. Listen, he's actually not that bad then. Because what can I really say apart from the fact that he can do anything? I mean, 13 technique, can't really see, but it's still 11. I mean, now now man is looking at the scraps, can't lie, but that's that's where we've come to now. Can't lie, bruv. I mean, maybe in the future he might improve in that, but if I had to decide, yeah, where would I actually play this guy? I'm looking at it now. He claims a normal left winger. Um, he's got no agility, so I can understand that, bruv. Um, you know what? As a left mid, that's that's actually not looking too bad. Can't lie. Um, yeah, either as a left mid or a centre mid, bruv. Those are the way that that's the fuck. <laughs> those are the two positions that man play him in still. Yeah, man. Like, um, this this guy, bruv. All right, next we've got Alan Zegiev, bruv. Um, I pronounced that so wrong, but listen, I would have never pronounced it right anyway. Now, um. 30 years of age and yeah when i look at the stats I already know what kind of guy this is bruv you know them old man that just have mad tech yeah mad, he's just one of them man there bruv um listen 14 technique 15 vision and 14 passing he's passing the ball first touch 15 controlling that anticipation he can anticipate when the ball's gonna drop bruv he knows a lot of things that are going on around him and that bruv he knows you get me mentally overall he's decent obviously the composure is lacking decisions lacking by one composure lacking by two but i'll let it slide bruv because as a deep line playmaker he's he's actually he's, he's decent can't lie bruv mad mad determination and aggression as well don't fear no one with that bravery as well bruv apart from the most high bruv you get me like fam he's moving mad and obviously as long as you've got a good pivot in the midfield you do not need physical ability and what i mean is i would genuinely play someone that has two 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 as long as they've got a pivot all above 14. That's me personally, in it? Because I know they don't need to move. They don't need to be strong as long as they're in a possession system. Out of possession, that's why you would have someone next to him like a box-to-box that can kind of break up play or, or like a little Roman kind of guy that, that's got decent tackling next to him and that, bruv, to, 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 to do that stuff, yeah. But for me, he's he's, he's a decent little um, deep plan playmaker still, man. Like Alan Zagyoev, bruv, you get me? Cool. All right, next you've got a very, very sad injury right here, man. Man's gone for three to five months, but you're, you're missing a lot. I can't lie. This guy, he's a gem. He's a gem still. He is a gem. He is, like, man, like, it is that Akemitov. Yeah, man's a gem. Can't lie. 22, still within that youth academy bracket, bruv. 15, te- oh, shit. But, but listen, I don't even care about the vision right now. I'm going to keep what I said, bruv. Listen. 15 technique, 12 vision and 14 pass. The man will let that pivot slide. But just just tell him to put on some some goggles, bruv. You, you, you know that that old school footballer with, with the dreads? Yeah, just slap on those, innit? Simple. Anyway, um, man, man's got 14 first touch and 14 dribbling. So he's cushioning the ball and he can drive with the ball forward as well. 14 flair as well and composure and anticipation. Like, he's just moving mad. So, it for me, it's it's not a deep thing. I can't lie. As long as he... I mean, as, I, I mean, I mean... I know he has got 13 tackling, but personally, I'm not putting him deep. I'm going to ask him to play Mazalas still. I'm going to tell him to pick up the ball and drive, break lines, bruv. That's what I'm going to tell him to do still. Literally, pick up the ball, drive, break lines, and, and just pass the ball. That's all he's going to have to do still. Like, I don't expect him to shoot. I don't expect him to score goals. That's why it's on support, not attack, bruv. You get me? Yeah, man. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. All yeah. right, uh, next we've got Ivan Oblakov, bruv. Um... He's a deep line playmaker. Um, he's 22, 13 technique, 13 vision, and 13 passing the pivot. I'll let that slide, bruv. One away from 14. I'll let it slide. 13 first touch, 13 anticipation, 14 composure, 14 decisions. Yeah, man, he can do it still. I'll let, I'm let, I'll let him do it. You get me? He, he can pass. He can control the ball. He's got composure. He's got anticipation. And he makes the right decisions. Like, what, what else do you really need in it? Like, the things that I needed, man listed them. And he's got them all... Minimum 13. I know it's only 13, but it's only under average by one. So I'll let it slide still. Yeah, man, like Ivan Oblyakov. Um, yeah, he's, 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 he's a good deep plan playmaker, man. He can do his thing still. All right, next we've got Konstantin Maradishvili, bruv. Um, he is a ball in the midfielder defend. Um, he's only 20. 
now um, because of his age I have to look at a lot of things and give him uh, give him a chance you get me um, now he cannot oh man yeah see now this guy yeah um, he's he's like the opposite of the deep line playmaker that I said that I would take with two 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 but has a good pivot he's literally the opposite because on the ball he's completely useless brav like he's he's useless like like man man just has no 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 ability on the ball but off the ball he can do a little thing still regardless of the off the ball and the positioning thing it's true brav like what is he gonna do on the ball that he cannot do off the ball like come on brav so he's gonna be running around booting man shin pads yeah and and getting away with it and and that's all he's gonna do literally not a footballer just just a shin pad booter <laughs> i swear Man's just a shin pad booter, bruv. That's all he is, man. Like, um, I don't even know his name no more. I, I, I don't want to know his name no more. He's not a footballer, bruv. Come on now. All right, next we've got Naya, this guy. And um, he is an attacking fullback. 10 dribbling, 11 crossing. Forget about it, bruv. You get me? It's not happening still. Um, I know he's 21, but listen, there's there's only so far you can go. And, and, and for me, he's taking it too far, bruv, like. I can understand if at least one or even two were about 10 or 11. But when 95% are 10 and 11, I'm sorry, but I, I just can't save you, bruv. I can't, fam. I just can't save you. Like, no matter what system I play, you will remain useless, bruv. So, the man's going to have to exit the card still. Save. All right, next we've got Emil Bohanian, bruv. Um, 14 technique for Envision and 14 passing. So, he can kind of pass the ball, let's be real. Um, he can bang it from far comfortably. He, he's composed, bruv decisions on average by one um flary and yeah overall th those are some good things that i just listed he's 21 you get me dribbling is 12 crossing 12 so he has to work on those that's probably the first thing that i would work on personally and physically you can't really do anything about that apart from maybe strength little weight training that's at your own risk of injury and that but roll the dice man fuck it yeah but personally i'll train him to dribble still because i can definitely see this guy turning into one of them slow but kind of like highly productive in terms of end product wingers, bruv. Yeah, even though he's a natural midfielder, I'll probably keep him out wide still, can't lie to you. That's my personal thing. Yeah, my little Emil Boing, bruv. Uh, next, we've got Konstantin Kuchayev, bruv. Now, um, he is 22, centre mid, and can play a lot of positions as well. Now, um, look at the stats. He's got an okay pivot, 13 technique, 13 vision, and 14 passing. I mean, 13 technique, 13 vision, and 13 passing. So the pivot is 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 just it's mediocre. Let's be real. Um, it's all under average by one. Um, good pace in a straight line, and the accelerations mean that it's going to take him a, a bit longer to get to that pace. But at least I know he's got it, bruv. Agility 14. Um, so so physically he's okay. Obviously in terms of strength, it's not there. But I was about to say, you know, when I usually say, I dare you try and test that strength because he's got mad flair, which I saw. But then I saw the dribbling. I have to question everything now so so now this guy yeah on the ball like he's 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 very unpredictable like man don't know if he's gonna go left or right but due to the fact that he hasn't got the best agility i mean fucking hell due to the fact that he hasn't got the best acceleration as soon as someone like gets an idea of where he's going and the fact that he's got no dribbling it's gonna be very easy to tackle him i can't lie it, it'll be very easy to win the ball off this guy up with like that bruv so based on that um you're probably going to either have to improve the dribbling or, or just um, not ask him to dribble at all. That's that's what, that's what probably what I'm going to do still. It's either you improve the dribbling or just cancel it at, at, as, as a whole, bruv. Like, that's that's what I would do still. Man, like, um, Konstantin Kochayev, bruv. Like, he's 22. It's not too late. Maybe you can get the dribbling to about 13, 14 in, in about two, three years, bruv, while he's still very young in it. So, yeah, that's what I would do. That's my first mission for this guy still. Man, like Konstantin Kuchayev, bruv. Apart from that, he's, he's an okay midfielder, though. So, yeah. All right. So, um, today I was playing a game with one of my people. Um, it's called Outriders, yeah? And and there, there's some bosses on that game that are just OP, like overpowered, bruv. And, and when I just looked at this guy's stats... Got, got flashbacks man like the amount of times i fucking died on that game trying, trying to complete that shit and and you just can't do a thing because man's just got a strategy for everything that you've got bruv and 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 you're, you're just powerless like man man are trying to roll away and then you're getting zapped like from behind you man's teleporting in front of you blasting off your head bruv and you just can't do a thing and and that's exactly how i feel with this guy like what can you do as a defender 
as a defender, what can you actually do, bruv? Like, I'm, I'm genuinely thinking, what can you do? Like, as a defender, I'm pissed. I can't lie. If I'm a centre-back playing against this guy, right wing, cam, left wing, wherever he is, yeah? I'm pissed, bruv. I can't lie because what can you actually do? Like, like he's OP. He, he is. He's, he's, he's fake, bruv. He is. Like, I don't know how these men got this guy this good, yeah? But, but he's, he's amazing. Like, he's one of the best players that I've seen, especially considering his age. He's mad, bruv. Listen. Now, let, let me get into the stats, yeah? Fuck. Okay, now, bruv, listen, yeah. 14 technique, 14 vision, 14 pass. You have to get the pivot. You have to get the pivot. Like, like that's, 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 a, that's a good pivot, isn't it? Like, that's 14, 14, 14. That's a good pivot still. First touch, 14. Bruv, like, like con- controlling that on a mad thing. Now, dribbling, 16. Like, man's driving and, and not just driving, yeah? He's got flair to back it up as well. 14 flair, he's moving mad. I can't even lie, bruv. Like, he's, he's actually amazing. And to take the piss even more, adding all of those things for a cam, yeah? Man's got the decisions. Listen, he's got the decisions to back it up. So not only can he just split through a whole defence with the ball, he knows where to put the ball after he splits the defence, bruv. Meaning only one thing. In terms of getting goals and assists, he's moving mad. I can't lie. And I even forgot to say this. A lot of cams nowadays are slow because they don't have to run. But this guy... If he decides to slap on the burners, yeah, he slaps on the burners. Look at the physicals, bruv. My lord. Like, you know, you know them man there, yeah, like when, when you barge them off the ball, but they just still have the ball. <laughs> like, he's, he's just one of them man there. Like, you just can't do a thing because the balance is just crazy, bruv. Like, man's literally on the ground, but the ball's just still there. And, and you just can't get that shit, bruv. Yeah, it's, it's peak still. And, and a, a very important step for me, the determination, yeah. Man, man just wants to do his best, bruv. Adding to all of these stats, he's unstoppable, I can't lie. Like, how can you really stop him? What can you do? Nothing. I, I don't know what you can do. I don't. I, I ain't got an answer for this guy. He's amazing still. I've been on this card for time, but it's for very, very good reason, isn't it? Very good player, man, like Nikola Vlasic, bruv. Now I know that this guy, he's going to be a worldie in the future, bruv. Absolute worldie. Yeah, man, 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 man like Vlasic, bruv. Very good gem right there, bruv. Cool. All right, next you've got Chidera Ejuke. Um, he is a left winger cutting inside. Um, so he's right footed. Yes, he is. Now, good pace. You get me 16 acceleration, 17 agility, and 15 pace. He's moving. And the ball is stuck to his foot as well. And he is unpre- unpredictable. So now this guy on the ball, he can literally pick up the ball from either the right back or the left back and just dribble through any team. And they, they will struggle to get the ball off him still because they don't know if he's going left or right. And even if you do know if he's going left or right, you're going to have to actually work to get the ball off him because it's stuck to his foot, bruv. So, so that's what you're going to have to deal with firstly. But as a lot of things happen, not everybody's OP like that guy that we just saw. Some some people are actually human, yeah? And, and this guy is, is an example of like a, a normal player that just doesn't know what to do with the ball as soon as it's time to release it, bruv. Like, man can do everything on the ball. Like, he's got all the tricks on the world. Like, look, he, he tries tricks. He can do anything. But when it's time to release it now... Man's got nine crossing. Man's got eleven finishing. Man's got eleven long shots. Man's got twelve passing. That's that's okay, but nothing special. Like eleven vision, decisions. I mean the mentals as well. Those are like you know you know like um permanent marker. That's that's what I have to call the mentals nowadays. I'm gonna change that. Like listen, the man's gonna start saying that now because physically you can kind of change things. Yeah, men. I mean technically you can kind of you know change things apart from like specifically tackling. Yeah. You can, try, you can kind of change, like, let's say you wanted to improve someone's finish, you can do that still. Like, the dribbling, you can improve that as well. First touch and, and stuff like that, you can do that. But mentally now, that, that's a struggle because the mental things, you're either born with them or you're not. And and clearly, he's, he's not born with it still. So there's nothing you can really do about his mentals. And that's that's the permanent marker. Like, you just can't rub that out, bro. Other things you can kind of, like, edit and that. But this this mental thing is, is peak still. So, yeah, overall... Now that I know that he's 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 a mental disaster, it's it's peak. Like I can't really trust him now. Can't lie, bruv. Like he will look very good on on the driving and that with the ball, but releasing that is it's it's mythical still. Safe. Alright, next you've got Arno Sigurdsson. Um, he is a left wing or cam. What's the decisions? Twelve. Not happening, bruv. I've already got man like Vlasic. I think that's his name. That's the cam, bruv. Now, as a backup, um, is he young? Yes, he is. You know what? You know what? Man will give him a loan still. And I mean, he's not a, he's not on loan, so man can definitely loan him out. Yeah, that's what I will do still because he's hella like average right now. 
give him some first team football in it. Like he, he definitely needs it still. Man like um Arno Sigurdsson, cool. Alright, uh, next we've got Ilya Shikurin, bruv. Um now he's twenty. I'm pressing forward now. Nah 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 nah. This guy, yeah. Um he claims pressing pressing forward. That's only because he's aggressive, because he's got just under average work rate and the determination is eleven, bruv. So obviously Man's gonna say it's it's probably because of the aggression. Now, um, finishing is good, but not composed. Doesn't make the right decisions. So, as a pressing forward, I cannot agree with that. Still, um, I can't, fam. I just can't agree with it. Um, because as I always say, yeah, pressing forwards off the ball, they run at you like like a madman. But on the ball, they chat, they kind of change to advance forwards. Those need to be able to create for other people. Can he do that? Look at his passing. Look at his dribbling. That's your answer, bro. Meaning that he's not a pressing forward in it now. Um, advance forward. Definitely not. Target man on attack or support? May, maybe. Mate, what's his heading? Forget about it. <laughs> bruh, fuck, you know, bruv. All right, um, let, let, me just, let me just think. How, how, how am I going to play this guy, yeah? It might have to be a poacher thing, bruv. It might have to be a poacher thing still. I mean, if I had to, you know, it's going to be a poacher thing. Let me tell you why, yeah? Because his pivot is, is, is I mean, in terms of execution, it's dire. But he's got good technical ability and vision. So he, he knows what he wants to do. He just can't execute that, which is a very big pain, bruv. Um, but if I had to edit one thing or not edit, improve one thing naturally, it's going to be the off the ball still so that I can put in poacher com- comfortably in it. Yeah, because I do want him to be able to lose his marker and, and you're going to need off the ball for that still. So that's the first thing that I'm going to improve. And based on his finishing, it's not going to take him a long time to get to used to the, to get used to that role, bruv. So yeah, man, like Ilya Shishirun, bruv, whatever his name is. Mal turn him into a poacher still. Cool. All right, next we've got Fedor Chalov, brav. Now, um, pre- another pressing forward, 10 work rate, 17 determination and 13 aggression. So another one, just one out of the three that he's got, brav. Now, physically, very, very good. He's 22, 14 pace, 14 agility and 15 acceleration. So he's moving like very, very well, brav. Play short, simple passes, 13 technique, 14 vision and 13 passes. So he can pass as well. Um... Just can't really dribble, can't really shoot as well. Um, but he can pass though. So based on that, I'll put him deep playing forward support. I'll actually do that still. I know he's fast, but it's not like he's not going to be able to run. He's, he may run less, yeah, but he might like, I mean, you, you know what I mean in it. But yeah, um, mad flair though. Mad flair. Another reason why I would put him um, deep playing forward still. You could probably change this guy's whole position to a cam. You, you, I mean, he can kind of play there as well. It's competent. Oh, it's awkward. I don't care about awkward, bro. I might slap him in there anyway, bro. You know the one? Yeah. Um, not really a striker for me, you know. Can't lie. I, I can't really see this guy playing striker still. Like, look at his traits, bro. I mean, he plays his shots, but still, still, man. Plays short, simple passes and plays one twos. Like, this is more of a cam. This is more of a deep line forward than is a striker. So, for one of those, he's actually very good, bro. So, yeah. Man, like Fedor Chal. Ch- Chalov, brav, cool. And lastly, we've got Salomon Rondon, brav. Um, now, this guy, he was in the Prem. I remember him for being in the Prem, brav. One of them, you know, target men. Just just mad physical, brav. Good in the air. And I think he's still still possessing the same qualities, brav. As you can see, he's got a force field around him with that 18 strength, brav. And I ain't even lying. I've told you, man, about the Morello story. If you ain't heard the Morello story, I'll tell you the Morello story. That Morelos guy is a guy that plays for Rangers. He's got about 18 to 19 strength. Mounds on an online save with one of my friends. He was running in through one goal. One of my friend's centre-backs was about to block him and then he just moved out of the way. Just just as if he said, just go. <laughs> and, and and that's what I say. These men that have above 17 or 16 strength have got force force because man literally get shifted, bruv. And I ain't even lying. But yeah, um, another case of a shift in with that 18 strength, bruv. Mad balance as well. Um, physically dominating like a lot of people still. In terms of heading the ball, can't really win them. I mean, it's 13, it's under average by one, but he can definitely direct them though. So if anything is on his level, like if it's a whipped cross on his level, more time it's going to end up in the back of the net still. Now, first touch, chasing that, bouncing out of the stadium very comfortably, bruv. Cannot pass a ball. Works ridiculously hard, aggressive as well. And he knows where the goal is on the floor. And he's composed, so I think he's actually a he's a decent striker. I can't even lie. Like he's doing this thing, he'll bang a lot of goals, bruv. Man like Salomon Rondon, he's banging goals still. Man could put him target man on support based on the fact that he's strong, not even the fact that he can pass, bruv. 
Um, yeah, so overall, man, like Rondon, he's going to be a handful for you 10 strength defenders, bruv, that will get absolute... <laughs> let's, let's just leave it there, bruv, because you, you already know what he'll do to them, bruv, damn. And that is CSKA Moscow, bruv. Good gems in there. Thank you, Kyle. You get me? Man, man like Kyle gave me a shocking ability team before. And and then he started he started to show me like his 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 um his team still some gems there. I can't lie to you, bruv. Like big up Kyle, man. Like he, he he done well there still. That's that's a good team, man. Like um CSK Moscow. They got some gems in there still. So yeah, um I'm gonna show you man the club background and I'm gonna line these man up. You man can pause that and read that if you want to. But yeah, let's line these man up, bruv. Alright, this is how I'm lining up CSK Moscow, bruv. So, um, I know you got two injured players in there, but just take them out, bruv. I'm just showing you the strongest lineup possible right now, bruv. Now, um, I can thieve in goal. Um, I don't even know who this guy is, bruv, but man slapped him left back because he's the only left footed um defensive player that man's got right now, bruv. So you're gonna have to buy a left back still. Um they got Bruno Fuchs, bruv. Um He'll be a good ball player in the fan of them. Divi Von No Nonsense centre back, bruv. Young but promising, bruv. Mario Fernandez, wing back attack, not defend, bruv. Um Akimetov on some Mazella on supporting. Um Zagioev, bruv, on a deep line playmaker thing. And then you're gonna have to change this guy into an inverted winger on attack and ask him to develop his shooting. That's the first thing that I'll do. High intensity. Just just go all out on trying to improve his shooting. That's the only thing you can do. Just tell him to cut inside and bang it, bruv. That's all you can do with him still. Then with Bohin Yen, I decided to put him on that left wing, bruv. Because he had an okay pivot, yeah. Get him to, to learn learn how to dribble in it. That's that's what I would do still. And and then Chalov, deep line forward on support. Like he's, he's more of a cam than he is like a, a, a striker in it. So, man, put him deep line forward. And then Vlasic, I put him Trequista, yeah, so that he doesn't, um, I don't want him tracking back or anything. I only want him using his forward abilities, bruv, like, even if he can tackle, nah, even, he can't. But yeah, listen, just get him going forward, bruv, he's a gem, bruv. So yeah, um, that is how I'm lining up CSK in Moscow, bruv. Shout out Kyle one more time. Um, so yeah, you, man, if you like that video, like that video. Subscribe to the content you know what to expect from me, and I'll see you in my next episode, bruv, safe.